pump down because this unit have an history of gas leaking last time we visited we just stopped up 1408 refrigerant and now it's time for the operation okay we're going to see the refrigerant into this condenser unit okay not into the compressor into into the hole okay the refrigerant goes to the pipe okay and right now we're going to close the but before that, I'm going to close this first, the one part, the three part part. Okay, then I proceed to the high side pipe. In order to do that, yes, guys, just put a look here. If it goes to 10, then it's time to close this plus side pipe. Oh, I'm sorry for that. This hose is the culprit. So that's it, guys. The procedure is close this the high side. Okay, after closing that, then the gates going down at 10. Yes, start closing the, this bulb, okay? The low side. And it's time for the operation. The leak. We found the leak in the evaporator. So, we're going to bring back the refrigerant into the system. Okay, to do that, you open first the high side, okay? Not this one. A lot of technician does it, okay? If you do here, more refrigerant, refrigeration oil going to the system. So, better release the gas, open this bulb like that, okay? And look at the gates reading, it's going up, okay? And I'm going to continue. Opening the valve. Okay, that's the proper way of releasing the refrigerant to the system. Okay, here, and don't forget to open this one also. There. There is it. So that's all for now, guys. By the way, this is five ton inverter. Nice. 